What up, it's your boy, Nick Incredible Man, and this is the Rising Up the Shield Hero Season 2, Episode 2. Yet again, I am excited, I love it, I cannot wait, so let's dive into this episode and see what's popping off, man. I don't think I do it good, no, I think I do it great. They would do it if they could, they can't do it, so they hate. Everybody wanna look, but nobody wanna play. Stealing eyes. Because now we got introduced to this random chick that wants Nafumi to kill her. Maybe she's the cause of the of the tortoise. Well, he's a little messed up. There it is again. Wait, maybe the tortoise is trying to kill her? Maybe she's owned the tortoise. Let's get it, man. Episode two, Footprints of the Spirit Tortoise. Is that all the other leaders meeting? So it's like a thinning, thinning of the herd. It kind of cleans out these kingdoms that's densely populated, right? Don't y'all looking at me for it. I'm the only one that's here to help. Man, that is not going to help. And it didn't do nothing, right? But the other three don't want to help. Right. I feel like it needed to be said. Some of these people are go, are go out there and try to die heroes. Dying ain't cool. Living is what's cool. <laughs> I'm so hungry. <laughs> well, now, who is that? What's the seven star heroes? Oh, that's right. We did meet. Yeah, we met a couple of them.
Yeah, we've met a couple of them. Better than nothing. That's the, ch the chick with the fans, right? Oh, that's a chick from the other day. Okay, so things are getting interesting. How is that possible? Yeah, the monsters. Oh, she takes own human form. Oh, wow. Oh, shoot. But for what purpose, though? Because everybody was teaming up to fight the waves. Because nobody was fighting because they were trying to fight the waves. And somebody's controlling the spirit tortoise. Let's take care of them first. It's a last resort. Oh, shoot. Wow, this is way bigger than I expected. So who has the power to break the seal besides the four heroes?
<laughs> we know that. Anything else? She's a familiar, dude. That ain't gonna do nothing. Yeah, you just gotta figure out a way to cut the head off. See, this is where it gets stupid. Everybody want to be in charge. That, that ain't the problem right now. We got to find a way to actually cut off the head. Because we still have to deal with the waves after this is all over. He's not wrong. Right. This ain't the time for all that. He's not wrong, man. We got way bigger stuff to deal with, man. Instead of who gets the glory for defeating the spirit tortoise. Okay, now who is this? He's the one controlling the spirit tourists, right? It is not a good thing. <laughs> Philo. Look at that, all, all this greatness, man. She really did step up, man. I don't quite trust her yet. I don't quite trust her yet. I keep her at arm's length, just, just a little bit.
mean, not if I can help it, I mean. That we don't have a way of stopping the spirit tortoise because everybody's trying to argue about who takes credit. It's not that simple because they want credit. This ain't work. This is not the time to be worried about credit. That's not Philo. Right? I mean, um, Reptilia. Okay, it may be her. But I'm 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 skeptical now because of the the tortoise familiar girl. Oh, this seems like a legit plan. They're going to use it to slow down the spirit tortoise. This seems like a legitimate plan, though. <laughs> Should I eat it? Probably, you know, I still don't trust her, man. I'm, I'm just saying I don't, I don't. I would like to, but I just don't. It seems like a legitimate plan, but I mean, with this chick being here, you know what I'm saying? Not knowing if we can actually really trust her. I mean, I know she has her reasons because, you know, somebody's controlling the spirit tortoise. <laughs> Look at the big old bow Philo has. <laughs> <laughs> quick quick <laughs> yes uh, for some reason she just infatuated with the bow hero and you know
I seduced a ton of royals. <laughs> you know what she meant? Well, you're old enough. I think you. I think. I think it's cool. <laughs> Ah, don't worry about it. I'm assuming the dude with the glasses is controlling the spirit tortoise. I knew it was going to happen. I knew, like, right when it got real good, it was going to end. Okay, man. That was The Rising of the Shield Heroes Season 2, Episode 2. Um... Overall, the episode was legit, man. It was more informative than anything. We learned that the chick that we met last week is a familiar of the spirit tortoise. And more than likely, she's not the only one that takes on a human form. The others are, you know, monsters that um, Reptilia and Nafumi and everybody fought last week. But she takes on a human form. And I'm assuming she's not the only one. Then we also learned uh, just a little bit more about the seven star heroes. And we met... A couple of them actually but we also learned that some of them are re not re no, isekai into this world and then some are actually chosen from this world but they're not quite as strong as nafumi and the others but we saw them fighting in season one so like they, they can definitely handle their own and bring something to the table and that's what nafumi mentioned when they were having this round table discussion is that you know it's better than nothing, you know what I'm saying? And they can actually use a couple of attacks that may be pertinent to uh, taking down the spirit tortoise if they can get there in time or whatever. Now, they decided on the plan and they're going to enact it with everybody kind of cooperating and bringing something to the table. But now Fumi kind of just threw it up there for a minute. It was like, hey, man, if you guys, if all you guys care about is obtaining the glory of doing it and then dying in battle, you know, I'll come up with a plan and my group uh, handle it. And I feel like... You know, Raptilia kind of laid it out for him that, you know, well, we don't have to go about it this way. And I'm glad that you care about my village, but we really need their help. And, you know, these people actually care about their towns, too. So we see that Raptilia is kind of that voice of reason when now Fumi kind of get lost in his consciousness a little bit when he's kind of just solely focused on something. You know, she's the one that kind of brings him back down to reality just a little bit. I thought that might have been old girl kind of playing as Raftilia because she was saying all this night. I mean, she was saying all the right things. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not saying that Raftilia can't say these things, but I don't trust this chick, man. I mean, sure, I get that she has her reasons because the spirit tortoise is being used by someone else. But at the same time, you know, you just came straight up out here and told us that the life that you had been living was a lie and that you had used your means to trick a bunch of these other nations into fighting. So... Forgive me if I'm taking everything that you're saying at face value. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't. So I was a little skeptical about her. But it seems like right now she's holding up her end of the deal. We'll just have to see how it plays out. Now, I feel like this season just might um take place with the whole thing taking on the spirit tortoise. And we may see the waves probably maybe in the last six or so episodes probably possibly i don't know because I, I don't read the manga or anything but i am intrigued because it, it seems like the spirit tortoise is going to be a huge threat this season and the others are definitely going to have to come in because the seven star heroes are not as strong as the 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 cardinal heroes so i'm excited to see where it goes and it, it kind of got a little lighthearted towards the end but then, then boom bam the spirit tortoise came in so I can't wait to next week's episode, man. This is Roddick Incredible. Don't forget to smash the like button so you can't smash any more. Comment down below and I'll be sure to respond to each and every one of them and subscribe, but only if you really want to, man. And remember that anime matters, anime is greatness, and anime is life, man. Peace out.